Good evening. I hope everybody had a great Friday today, and I hope you're doing really good. Um, the other day, I was reading an article that was talking about taking care of neighbors, and one of the things that it said in it that really just kind of stuck in my head was that we're all in this storm together, but we're not always necessarily on the same boat. Different people have different things going on with them, and it, so we're just not all exactly the same, even though we're all in the same stay at home and stay apart from each other kind of storm right now. So this idea about the storms and the boat just kind of kept sticking in my head. So I thought today I'd read a story about Jesus and a storm. So it says, this is from Luke chapter eight. And it says, one day he got into a boat with his disciples and he said to them, let's go across the sea to the other side of the lake. So they put out and while they were sailing, he fell asleep. A windstorm swept down on the lake and that, and the boat was, well, the boat was filling with water and they were in danger. They went to him and woke up shouting, master, master, we are perishing. And he woke up and rebuked the wind and the raging waves and they ceased and there was calm. And he said to them, where is your faith? They were afraid and amazed and said to one another, Who then is this that he commands even the winds and the water and they obey him? So see, Jesus was there in the boat with the disciples and they were still frightened and he calmed everything for them. And that's how he can be with us. He will calm things with us when we talk to him and when we hand over our storms to him. And now we might be in the same storm, but my boat might not be the same as your boat. So the things that I need might not be the same as what you need. But Jesus knows exactly what we all need and will take care of that. And we can help by also being good neighbors and calling each other and just trying to help out with whatever boat they're in and being there for them and trying to help them find that calm along with Jesus calming it for them. So let us say a prayer tonight. Dear Father, protector of all, thank you for today. Thank you for the reminder that you are always with us in the storms, in the boats, and in the calm. Help us always to remember to love our neighbors and to be mindful of the storms they may be going through so we might step into the boat with them and along with Christ, our Savior, help them to find their calm. Amen. So I hope you have found a little bit of calm today and that maybe tomorrow you can help somebody with whatever storm and whatever boat they're in. So we'll see you. I hope you have a great evening for the rest of the evening and we will see you tomorrow. Good night. Sleep tight.